the hell is he babbling about? Man, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Fine. Go ahead. Tell him. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Doug, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little piss ant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife The child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kitty, listen to me. You can warp his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! Kenny, I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure! Take a vote! This is America! Fuck it! But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave it. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? I've seen enough of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. I vote Ben stays with us. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? <laughs> Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's gotta be a way out down here. <laughs> Fuck! It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Lee, look!
here this leads to the roof we might be able to find a way down from there you didn't come into town from the railroad did you yeah why never mind i can see the sewer where we came in from here i think we can do this well what are we waiting for go go Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Hold on. Is he... dead? Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Already? We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk, in private. Listen, man. About what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? 
I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me, to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? You're coming at me with a lot here, Vernon. I need to think it over. Of course, take your time. But I want you to think about some things. You're a good man, Lee. You've been protecting these people as best you can so far, and they look up to you. Rightly so. But it's different with a child. You might have brought her this far, but sooner or later she might ask you for more than you can give her. I'm sorry if that's hard to hear, but it's the truth. I appreciate it, Vernon. Let me think about it, okay? You do that. somewhere yeah I'm about to head out I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything it's been fun what are you talking about Kenny's working on the boat right now thought you were coming with us God knows you earned it yeah I've been thinking it over it's not for me sounds like it'd be pretty crowded and I never did like the water you sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. He's just feeling down right now. Truth is, he brought this on himself. What do you mean? Look, Ben's a good kid. He means well. Keeps trying to help. But every time he does, he winds up putting the rest of us in even more of a jam. What happened to Kaja and Duck feels like he was responsible for that. And the fact is, he's right. He was. But you still saved him. Yeah, I still saved him. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe.
Clementine? 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 Clementine! Oh, God. here? Lee! Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. I don't know why you're looking over here, Lee. Hell, I can't remember the last time you went out on a limb for me, if ever. And I've got a boat to prep. Kenny, you know what Clementine means to me. She's my family now. She's all I got. Family? <laughs> you're gonna talk to me about family. You're lucky I don't knock you on your fucking ass right now, you selfish son of a bitch. You can do whatever the fuck you want, but you'll be doing it on your own. What about you, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? You're right. I owe her. I swear. Before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. Come on, guys. Let's go.
the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! Are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Nächstes Mal die Zeit wäre knapp. Oh yeah, und damit ein kurzes Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu der Folge von The Walking Dead. Ich hoffe, euch hat die Folge gefallen zu meinen Der Junge auf dem Dachboden. Du und 73 diese Spiele haben ihn umgebracht. Ähm, Hippokratischer Eid. Du und 73 diese Spieler waren rational und aufrichtig. Hast du werden belohnt oder bedroht? Hm. Allein zu Haus. Ach ja, das Betonen habe ich leider äh, also da nicht gemacht in diesem Sinne. Ähm, ich habe äh, ja den anderen Stand laden müssen, nachdem irgendwie mein Spielstand weg war. Keine Ahnung. Aber hey, ist jetzt egal. Die äh, also die Sachen, die wir in dieser Szene erlebt haben, sind alle Real und echt, würde ich so äh, sogar unterschreiben. Hast du Clementine mitgenommen? Du und 40% der Spieler haben sie mitgenommen, wenn die Stunde schlägt. Hast du Ben in den Tod stürzen lassen? Du und 40% der Spieler ihn aufs Dach gezogen. Hm. Also, dass die Mehrheit ihn runterfallen lassen hat, ist schon traurig, aber okay. Zeigen des Bisses. Also den Grob wird der Biss gezeigt und dass die Spieler haben den Biss gezeigt. Ja, weil es sehr wichtig ist, dass die Gruppe das weiß. Wer begleitet Lee? Äh. Ja gut. <lacht> Wir haben auf jeden Fall die Mehrheit. Uns fehlt eigentlich nur der da oben, wie heißt es? Äh, Kenny, aber das mache ich so Latte, der Typ. Und ja, das war's auf jeden Fall mit der, ähm, mit dem Kapitel, meine Freunde. Und ich hoffe, ich sehe euch beim nächsten Kapitel wieder, weil es geht gegen Ende zu, wie ihr gemerkt habt. Und ja, seid einfach gespannt, was noch auf euch zukommt. Tiddler.